I think that chamber music in general, and string quartets in particular, are a very conversational art form. In chamber music, we have the interplay between the individuals involved, and uh, each has a role. And it's not as if one player is assigned to a, a fixed role for the duration of the piece. Who's on top, who's playing middle voice, who's playing the, the bottom voice. It's not always predictable. In fact, it's rarely predictable. I'm particularly excited about the program that we're going to play. Uh, Bach, you can't go wrong with Bach. It is a dark, melancholy work in the slow movements, but in the two fast movements it's full of energy and rhythmic vitality. Everything that we love about Bach is present in this sonata. Uh, the Brahms sonata uh, in G major, the first of the sonatas that he wrote for violin and piano, he wrote to a friend that the composition came so easily to him that it seemed as if during his walks in the countryside that the melodies just came to him out of the air. The Sanson Sonata is virtuosic. It has a brilliant kind of perpetual motion idea in most of the last movement. The slow movement is, is very tender, very beautiful, and it has a very light kind of mercurial scherzo in, in G minor. Uh, it, it really has everything that one could hope for in a romantic violin sonata. I'm excited about the upcoming performance because I sense a great deal of energy from Kevin and the other uh, young musicians who were involved with this series, and I'm very glad to be able to fit into that. Mm -hmm.